Okay, YouTube, so we are back with the 7 Days Jumping Jacks Challenge by Ogum Series. Today is my day two, and if you are joining the challenge, do not forget to tag Art Ogum Series, okay? So, all you need to do is 100 jumping jacks per day for 7 good days. Now, don't tell me that's too much. That's a very good start. It's just 7 days before you know you're done and dusted and all you need to do is 100 jumping jacks now if you cannot do 100 jumping jacks straight up then you can break it into 10 10 20 20 just anyhow or you can do it twice like 50 if you can do the first time 50 rest for a few seconds and then start another 50 that's 100 jumping jacks if you want to do it 20 20 20 do that and get it done and dusted okay the goal is don't stop don't don't quit, start moving, let's burn fat, let's burn calories, let's make sure that we are in good health. Right now, I'm just warming up. Now, something else I would love to share, I'm doing mine with a little bit of twist and, I'm, I, I'm, and I am going to tell you why. Now, if you're someone that you're doing certain exercise and your body is now used to that exercise, you might not burn so much fat. This goes for any exercise, even skipping. If you're somebody that you can just pick up your skipping rope and skip 1,000, 500, 200 non-stop. At a point, you have to start mixing it up. You have to keep the body guessing if you want the body to burn more calories, more fat, and all of that. You need to keep your body guessing. So yes, I am able to do 500 jumping jacks straight up, non-stop. So I decided since it's a 100 jumping jacks challenge, I'm going to mix it up with some other exercises just to keep my body guessing so I can achieve a lot out of this seven days challenge right we want to be healthy that's the goal okay and some of us might want to burn tons of fat you know when you burn some calories some unhealthy calories and all of that so if you fall in this category then you can do what i am doing here where you see me stop and i added some other movements in between and then i continued with my jumping jacks and completed my jumping jacks okay or you can do the 100 jumping jacks and then add other exercise at the end or at the beginning. Do whatever is comfortable for you. But if you're starting up, like my the first by day one, someone dropped a comment. I think it was Salito. Yeah, Salito Salani. I think she dropped a comment there, letting me know that if she's doing just ten, it gets she gets all tired and all of that. So if you fall under that category, that when you do 10, 20, 30 jumping jacks, you get tired. Then of course this is perfect for you because this is going to challenge your body, and you're going to be getting tons of results from this because you're not able to do a lot at once so keep moving okay if it's that 10 you can do do it so at this point i have completed my 100 jumping jacks it's time for cool down right now this is something you do not need to forget if you do your jumping jacks and you don't cool down you don't stretch then you're going to feel pain and this is a seven days challenge so this is something that you have to wake up the next day and repeat the same process right so always remember to get your stretch it is so so important if you don't stretch your shoulders your arms is going to hurt so bad that day two day three day four you might not want to move you're just going to cancel it and you will not complete the challenge well at this spot i'm just posing for thumbnail because my day one i didn't get to take a photo of thumbnail i have just few minutes to film a video and i don't have time to take photos for thumbnail separately so yes that's something you can do in your video if you're a content creator you know that right when you're filming the video you can just pose here and there for thumbnail okay so here place your hands on the wall and stretch this is perfect this is a good one it will help the muscles not to hurt in your arms it will help your shoulder the soreness and even if you're having shoulder soreness already it is going to help relieve that pain okay so place your hand on the wall uh, something that is stable okay don't place your hand on, on something that is not stable so you don't fall over after you do the single hand then do the double hand because that is going to help you okay so do the double hand on the wall press your both hands on the wall and push stretch properly so you don't feel any ounce of pain seven days challenge i know you can do it okay health is wealth okay? health 
fat in the world. And jumping jacks is not only good for just you burning fat and getting that uh, body figure that you want or losing weight and all of that. It's good for your heart health, okay? Your heart and all the organs inside of you is going to be functioning properly, blood flow.